Environmental Institute of Houston studies the Dimeback Terrapin because it's a very unique turtle. This turtle is unique because it's the only turtle in North America that lives in the bra brackish water and estuaries. And so, you know, in the whole estuary system, it, you know, it's in some areas, or some papers, some research has said that this turtle can be like a keystone species, you know. So it's important to the environment, it's important to, you know, reduce the amount of little rhina so they don't, you know, eat all the spartina, which is, you know, important for other species. So it's almost, it's almost like it holds, you know, it's important to hold that ecosystem together. This is the only species that is adapted to the brackish saltwater marsh environment that we find the diving back terrapin in. All the other sea turtles are out at sea and they, they'll come in in juvenile stages but they'll stay in the water whereas these terrapin go on land as well. One of the ways in which we study these turtles is by tracking them with uh, radio transmitters. We attach them to the, the upper shell which is the, the carapace and we use a radio receiver and antenna to track them on land with uh, these radio trackers. And we also attach acoustic transmitters to the shells too. And these emit a, a acoustic signal underwater. And we are able to track them with a handheld receiver and we have uh, stationary receivers on the islands and in other areas to track them as well. When we capture a terrapin, we mark them using a unique uh, number mark by filing a notch in there on the edge of their uh, shell. And we also um, insert a pit tag, which is a passive uh, transmitter that we scan and we, it has a unique number. So this is two ways of confirming that the turtle we have in hand is the turtle that we think it is. And this is also used with the mark recapture study to estimate population size. You know, uh, I think it's back in the 1800s. It was uh, it was uh, used a lot for food, so it was um, like a delicacy. And so, you know, it was it was declining. And so we were trying to study it and get as much information as they have up north, you know, so we can use that or you know, kind of be in the same realm that they are and be able to protect this turtle the way we need to.